Hey y'all, Rochelle here, your delightful crafter. Um, so I hope y'all had a great weekend. I've been kind of working around the house. Um, found out my son and his wife are coming down next week. So I'm pretty excited. So got to get the guest room ready, all that fun stuff. So I'm, I'm, I'm like over the moon. Anyway, if you're new to my channel, welcome. Um, I, I hope you enjoy your stay. Um, if you like what you see, please hit that subscribe button. Ding the bell next door. If you want to get notifications of future videos, thumbs up, likes are always appreciated. And any questions or comments, please leave them down below. So, tonight is going to be a Dollar Tree haul. I meant to do this this morning, but I've just kind of, I've been tired because I was working in the house yesterday cleaning, so y'all know how that goes anyway. Um, yeah, so let's see what I found. The store had a, lot, had a lot of summer stuff out, so like, I think I love luau's. I didn't pick up a lot because I still had some from last year, but I picked up a couple items, mainly um, these pineapple straws, however, I don't think I'm going to use them for a luau. I'm going to do something. Look at that. There's a... You see that? I just noticed there is a hair in the package. Um, yeah, that's not going to get used in drinks. <laughs> ah, nice. Um, I was going to use them as, I, I don't know, in some project. I haven't decided yet. Um... Yeah. Here, we'll uh, open this up and see what one of them looks like. Let's see. Alright. Open it up. Kind of stuck together. I'm a little, woof. I took my my, um, well that's there's no way for it to stay. It doesn't give you a way to keep it open. And if you turn it all the way around. Okay. Well. Kind of an odd pineapple. We'll have to see what I can, I can uh, do with those. Because, yeah, it's a little awkward. Anywho, maybe I'm supposed to, I don't know. The ones I've seen before, they have like a little deal to tuck. Maybe I'm supposed to like tuck that leaf or something. Let's see. Or not. Well, that's that. <laughs> Dollar tree for you. And then, of course, I had to get these little cocktail stirs because of the flamingos. Not quite sure what I'm going to do with those yet, but they were fun and they had to come home. And they had this adorable little drink mug here with the flamingos. And I don't know, I might fill it with something. Yeah. I am so tired. I took my medicine and I'm like getting drowsy. I apologize. <laughs> I picked, oh, here are the flamingos. So here are these. These ones have little slits in them. So I'm hoping that they like go to, I, I don't know. I'll have to figure that out later. I'm not going to mess with it on here. But they had the flamingo ones. Then I picked up some more straws, the 4th of July straws. I didn't see these ones last time. So the last ones I showed were um, these ones here. And then the ones with the stars. And then just the flat, you know, the ones that are the flat red and white stripe. And then now they have these, the ones that are the red, white, and blue. So grabbed a set of each of those. And then they had these foldable fans. 
um, it gets hot in the where I work in the warehouse. So if it gets too hot, I guess I can just open this up and cool myself off just a little bit. That's kind of pretty, isn't it? Anyway, so there's that one. And I love I love foldable fans. When my son went and his wife went to China, they sent me back some absolutely gorgeous ones. Oh, they're beautiful. And then I saw this. Um, these a set of these is going to my friend P. P, in case you're watching, these little cuties are yours. Take your time. Take time to chill. Uh, was that lazy day? And free hugs. So, and then I got a set for me. So, there's that. And I have a thing. I can't stand anything on my teeth. So, I keep these in my purse. Little placards. That. A lot of people have been... A lot of the other Dollar Tree channels have been sharing um, Crayola permanent markers. And I found these three sets. And I think there's a few others, but these are the only three I found. Um, these are the black and blue. So they're called Always Onyx and All Nighter. And then we have Beat Goes On and Wild and Free. And then we have Bravocado and Infinite Oasis. So, and they say they're comfort grip, so I guess they're soft. I'm not quite sure. But I picked up a set of each of those. The littles across the street love chalk, and so I grabbed them some of the sidewalk chalk, the eggs. Uh, I probably should have grabbed some more, um, and I probably will, but every time... I'm in the Dollar Tree. I grab something for them. And this isn't a big haul, y'all. I picked up these. They're called LED Glow Art. So I think they're supposed to be like light brights. And they require two AA batteries. Here, let's open one up. There for the trash and looks like they're kept how do you get them out you can see them in there it's like a here we go it's stuck because they're in a package here we go well, it's kind of handy that you got a little storage drawer there. And I don't have any batteries, oh darn it, on me. Otherwise we'd try it out and play with it, but... This isn't something I would send across the street because their babyest is, she's, 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 uh, she's not, well, yeah, she's young. Anyway, got a little on and off switch, and instead of inserting paper, it's just, um, you just poke it in there and it holds the deals. Anywho, so I picked two of these up. And um, maybe I'll play with it when I'm bored. I don't know. Oh, I dropped one. And then um, the last haul, I had mentioned I like to go there and get stuff for laundry. And somebody had asked me what I do. And I remember because I was doing my mix today. So I love to use this uh, Arm & Hammer... Uh, it's called Fresh Burst, the Odor Blasters. So I, for each one of these, I, I get these at the Dollar Tree. And it doesn't really give it. It says it's fresh scent. But for each one of these, I do one of these. And I love the smell. 
and I keep giant apothecary jars on my washer and uh, I have three. Well, I have one on my dryer, two on my washer, and one of them holds, is full of this mix. The other one holds, I also do um, OxyClean odor blaster, because the guys in my house, they stink. <laughs> and um, so that, I keep a jar of both of those on top, and then my fabric softener and blah, blah. I layer I layer so much. I do gain, moonlight, something, fabric softener, dryer sheets, and laundry detergent. Then those crystals and the OxyClean odor blaster. And um, so, yeah, that's what I do. And then maybe once a year, I actually make homemade laundry detergent. And um, who knows? Maybe I'll do a video on that sometime. I actually got the recipe from... A friend of mine and it smells so good but it you have to buy a really large tub and you have to make it in a giant trash bag I get the 30 gallon trash bags to mix it up because it's like borax arm and hammer uh, Phil's naphtha uh, soap flakes the laundry crystals and something else. I can't think of what it is. I haven't made it in a while. But um, that works good. And you can use it in your high efficiency washers in case anybody's curious. Because it's a dry. It's not a... Some people do the, the homemade and it's like a gooey paste. I don't do that one because I'm worried that it might, you know, clog up piping. But so, But I do do the dry one. It works great. I asked my laundry dude, you know... Uh, when we have service done and he says yeah that's fine it won't hurt anything but anywho um, that's it it's not a big haul um, wanted to share it with you and again somebody had asked about the laundry stuff that I get at the Dollar Tree so shared that with you um, what else do I get I also like that fabuloso disinfectant cleaner I like to get the lemon one, and then they have a tropical one. I get that so for cleaning the bathrooms, but uh, that's it. That's it. Nothing big, nothing exciting. Uh, I was going to work in the craft room this weekend, but when my son called and said they were coming, that's when I was like, okay, time to strip the beds. and Because uh, I always strip. When I make the beds, I always put you know clean bedding on it. But even if the bed's been sitting there for like a week or whatever and somebody's coming, even though I know it's clean, I still pull it off and wash and, you know, put clean bedding back on. I'm just weird about that. Um, so just been doing a lot of laundry. You know, it was one of those weekends you pull down all the curtains and wash the curtains and put them back up. And um, my son hates that because he's tall, so he's the one that has to put the curtain rods <laughs> <laughs> but um yeah that's that's about it cleaning I was purging my closet again and um what else was I doing the dusting all that non-fun stuff but yeah that was my weekend I did get a small tonic order in but I decided I'm going to hold on to that um because I have a couple small orders and I'm just going to do like a collective haul later this week. So, and also in case you missed it in the last video, uh, the international Dex entry hasn't arrived yet. Um, I did reach out to her and let her know that if it's not in by next, by this coming Friday, um, I'm going to go ahead and hold the drawing um, for all the entries into the memory Dex challenge. So just, just letting y'all know that it's, it's not forgotten um, like I said, the international mail runs a lot slower now with, you know, the restricted air, you know, air international flights and stuff. So, um, I'm keeping my fingers crossed that it gets here. If not, we, like I said, we will be holding the drawing next, this coming Saturday. So, um, Friday night, I'll probably, depending on how I'm feeling, 
Friday night I will probably do the Parade of Memory Dex cards, and then Saturday we'll do the video of... I think we'll just include it in the same video. We'll do, like, I'll do a show of some of the items in the prize, because uh, like I said, I want some of it to be a surprise, and then uh, we'll do the, uh, the drawing for the winner. So with that, I hope you'll have a great night. I hope you have a fabulous week coming up. With that, love you guys to pieces. As always, happy crafting. Bye-bye.